Hello everyone, hello from the beach. I hope you can hear me. I'm in the tent, so I've got a nice windbreak, but it's still giving me some sun. I was just swimming and it's beautiful water here in the Canaries and I got scared by the shadow on the bottom thinking it could be a shark or a stingray. I realised it was my own shadow. I got scared of my own shadow. And it's what happens with us when we start seeing. It's what we're doing even when we're not conscious, is trying to hide from our own shadow, our own dark side. But it's been there all along. And uh, realising it was my own shadow, I reached out with my foot to see Oh, how deep is it? And it was, <laughs> I was swimming in water that was only a, you know, a couple of feet deep. So it's not so scary as I imagined at all. And then I just looked out in the sea and I'm, it's solstice and I'm floating in the ocean. The moon is out in the middle of the day and, and just the, everything has been put here for our enjoyment to harness to overcome to uh, utilize in some way some magical way and the ocean is just a great example of that you know all of the dangers and the perils and the joys and the, the fun and the perspectives you know here the 21st of of december is considered the beginning of winter and it's definitely midwinter in in England, you know, in the bleak midwinter. And just to see that all these different perspectives can exist simultaneously, and they're not wrong. And for one person, the wind on a beach is a big problem. For a kite surfer, or one of these water sports people, it's absolutely it's bliss. It's heaven. So. Oh, just divine, just divine. Mm. Yeah, I'm in heaven. Just wanted to send back a little slice of that for you.